messing with that beef, your bag's had a better holiday than you. <laughs> just, just sauntering through the door. Hello, hello. My, <laughs> in, in brand new designer clothing, I've been to Milan. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'll oh, take yeah. an espresso. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> My bags in that context, I take it you mean luggage and not testicles. <laughs> Depends where you pack for your holiday, Frankie. Just a lovely image of you, <laughs> you swinging and going. You check your testicles in. Yeah. <laughs> I just take them onto the plane with me. As long as they contain more than 100 millilitres of fluid. Uh, yeah, so. <laughs> People don't really... Baggage is a whole world. There's a site on the internet uh, that I happen to come across called... Um, Go on. <laughs> no, it's, it's called The Dull Men's Club. And on the, How did you find and on that? The, someone <laughs> told me about it. And yeah. what they do on the Dull Men's Club, so this we. was about two or three years ago, on the Dull Men's Club is essentially a list of all the world's airports and they list all the baggage carousels and they tell you whether the carousels go <laughs> clockwise <laughs> or counterclockwise. <laughs> Fantastic. You can just type in Lima, it says Terminal 1, clockwise. It's just <laughs> for example. <laughs> I thought they're reversible. Aren't they no, 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 the flaps, you know, the cat, they can only go one one. I've around. seen one go backwards. <laughs> <laughs> I swear I've seen one go backwards, and, and it's not a dream, because I have more interesting that's dreams than that. <laughs> <laughs> you'd, you'd worry if that was your yes, dream. That's no, what, yeah. no, that's better. <laughs> and when, when you saw it going backwards, you, you noted at the time. You yeah, I thought, with. well, I thought, you know, it's a machine, an electric I machine, I am a scientist. And they, they just put it into reverse, and now it's going backwards, and, and that's Could you see your luggage, and you were just about to pick it up, and then suddenly it was going away <laughs> from you? What, what it was, was I sort of turned, turned up, having got off the plane, and was standing in the waiting area, and, the, and it started to go round, and went round for a few yards, and then it started to go round the other way. That's and just a warm-up lane. The... <laughs> well, <laughs> but it still, yeah. it showed a capability to go in both directions, <laughs> albeit only briefly in one. But in I didn't opinion, think, oh, well, I suspect just... witchcraft. <laughs> have you been on there? Have you been on this website, David. I think you'd when quite you, enjoy it. When well, I think that website this. sounds the most pointless thing in the world, because it's yeah. saying it can only go clockwise, and I know it can go both ways. <laughs> so I'm going to go on that website, I'm going to hack into it, and I'm going to change them all <laughs> from clockwise or anti-clockwise to both directions. Both directions. Both directions. <laughs> David, at what point during the watching the baggage carousel go the wrong way around? I didn't know it was the wrong way at that well, point, I, I accept it, I accept yeah. it. Watching it go both ways, yeah. then. Did you go this is something that will make a fantastic anecdote <laughs> on a leading comedy show. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just, I always knew it was a great story. <laughs> <laughs> just needed a niche. Yeah. Well, that's, well, that's, well, that's stored yeah. away for the future. Just, just like the, the wonderful day that I noticed they were changing the way they had the buttons to press for traffic lights. <laughs> I thought, blimey, this is, these are great times I'm living in. Oh, very good. <laughs> Yeah. You always find, you know what I mean, you know when it sort of goes around, you forget what your bag looks like, it's horrible, you find yourself going, right, oh god, oh no, I wish I had a purple bag. <laughs> so what, my bag's going in the opposite direction to everyone else. Absolutely. <laughs> I, like, <laughs> I like to stuff mine full of elves so it gets near me just here, bang bang. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, Gideon. Oh, Mr. Howard. Oh, <laughs> Let's get you some Horlicks. Thank you. Um, but once, the worst, I, I went for a wee just before and, um, you know, in a toilet, oh, I'm a cat, I'm not a beast. <laughs> And uh, then I came back and there was this... Do you think, by the way, if you did wee in the toilet, you'd actually see it coming back around again? <laughs> yeah. 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 This, uh, and I, went, I went for a whiz and then I came back and there was this sort of bag going around that said, uh, uh, inflatable dolls treat with care. And he sort of... <laughs> and it went around, sort of, about three... <laughs> and then I realised that what happened, after I'd been for a wee, my mates had written in Tippex on my bag. <laughs> and, that, and it was this moment of resident... Oh, that's my bag. <laughs> Like, Beast monster! Shut up. <laughs> I, I, I do, I'm desperately trying to move this arm, but well, I do I would, think. Yeah. I, before you do, <laughs> okay. I would just say how shit are British Airways when they've lost half your luggage, they don't even know how many lost bits of luggage they've got. Between 10,000 and yeah. 15,000. Yeah. That's 5,000 baggages they may or may not have lost. <laughs> the other argument they gave was we, we were introducing new working practices. What and sort of new working practices were they introducing? It's we're going to do fuck all with your luggage. <laughs> it, 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 losing luggage working practice, yeah. where you hand your luggage in, we burn it, and it saves, <laughs> saves a hell of a lot of time at the other end. <laughs> what a bunch of cunts. That, yeah. could be, that could be terrible, though. What if you had packed your testicles in there? And or an elf. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'd 
love it if someone just switched the episode on at that point. <laughs> <laughs> what if you packed your testicles in there and or an elf? <laughs> Mark the week is back. We really do have to move on. <laughs> We have beaten the shit out of the bags, carousel issue. <laughs> More so than it ever should have been done on a topical news clip. <laughs> so let us move though. on. But actually, first, why is it called a carousel? There's no fun element to it. Uh, so. The only ones used to have horses on them that went round and round. Because <laughs> you could ride on. Oh, like in oh Mary fucking shut up about <laughs> carousels. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason. <laughs> The only reason oh, we're talking you. about this is because <laughs> Hugh looked at some boring fucking website <laughs> instead of six hours of cock-hungry teens like a normal man. 